Some assignments that you will upload on Digication will be presentations, whether it be PowerPoint, Google Slides, or Keynotes. Unfortunately, Digication does not allow uploads of files of these kinds, for they are not compatible. Instead, you will have to convert your presentation file to a PDF document and upload them into a gallery module. Each application has a quick and easy way to save your presentation in PDF format. For example, on Microsoft PowerPoint, click on File in the menu and export as PDF. In Google Slides, click on File and download as a PDF. On Keynote, click File and export to PDF. Once you have your presentation in PDF format, it is ready to be uploaded to Digication. Open up Google Chrome, log in to Digication, and go to your ePortfolio. If you do not have a page yet for your assignment, create one by clicking on the Add Edit tab in the left column. Click on Add Page. Type in the title of your assignment and click Save. This page will need to be located in the right topic in the column. To do so, click on the Add Edit tab again and move your page to its proper category. For example, a presentation regarding the Revolutionary War, since it involves history, will go under the Social Studies tab. Be sure to indent your page to keep it organized. Next, you will need to add a module onto your assignments page. For a PDF file, you will need a gallery module. Select the gallery module and click on the button labeled Add This Module. Click on Add Media. On the next window, click Choose Files and select the PDF document you created and click Open. When it finishes uploading, click Done and then click Publish, otherwise your instructor will not be able to view your presentation. In addition to presentations, the gallery module can also be used to add multiple images, audio files, or video files to one assignment. Before you upload your media files, make sure that all of your files are in their proper formats. On your assignment, click on Add a Module, select Gallery, and click the button labeled Add This Module. Click on Add Media, and on the next window, click Choose Files. Go to the file location and select all the media files you want to upload, and click Open. After they all have finished uploading, click Done. There are certain changes you are allowed to make to your gallery. For example, Above the images, you are allowed to click and change the layout in how the thumbnails are presented. You are also allowed to rearrange the order of your files by simply clicking within the row and dragging the file up and down. In addition, the second tab in the row allows you to add a caption to your media files. When you have finished uploading and arranging your files, make sure that you click Publish, otherwise your instructor will not be able to view your uploads.